Hello guys, KP Shamino here and in this guide I'm going to show you guys how you need to catch this fish, the white sucker. So uh, he's from the carp family and they call him white sucker because he uh, got like very big lips and he's like soaking the bottom uh, for food. That's why they call it. It's a very beautiful fish I think, it's like a little bit of golden carp. And uh, yeah, it's really nice to, to get them. So I was fishing uh, here in Alberta for him today. And I was really surprised because this fish gives like 45 experience for one and a half kilograms. So that's really good uh, farmable fish for low level guys, I think. So that's a really nice, nice fish. So first of all, I'm going to show you guys the position. It's Santa's hut. And what you need to do is it's at the docks and it's at the same position as the burbot. But the good thing is because it's like from the family of the carp, the white sucker uh, eats vegetable bait. So you don't need to be worried that, uh, that you are going to catch a burbot. Because burbot is never going to eat vegetables, that's a predator. So therefore I'm fishing once again with the telescopic and it went really well. So I'm going to show you guys where you need to cast. So what I do is, I throw just in front of me. But I think you can get them everywhere here. It's not that there is a really good sweet spot, you just can get them everywhere. But I throw always in a straight line with the mountain over there or the reflection over here and here just in the middle between the two reflections so i'm always throwing around 13 meters you will see 13 14 meters it's something in between and then you just let your bobber be there and that's what you need to do but i think about the speed that this fish bites it's not as much as the channel catfish that's the thing that i need to say the channel catfish is a lot easier to catch than this one so if you need to choose i think this one is a little bit more experience i'm not sure i think it's a little bit more experience but this one is a really good leveling uh, fish too if you are low level so that's how you need to do it and then you need to wait until he bites of course and yeah that's it uh, for the time i got a little bit trouble in the morning so i started fishing in the sweet hours of the day and it seems to work so in a sunny day i fished from nine o'clock until now and i got i think let me think that's 10 that's uh, around 16 or 17 white suckers so that's a really decent farm in my opinion because that's almost uh, let me think 400, six, almost 800 experience. So that's a really good form, I think. So for my setup, uh, I'm still using the Telefloat 650, my Prima 3500. I'm using the Fluoro 0.2, a Sport Float, the Hook 1. Just a one hook. It doesn't really matter what you put on it because uh, all other fish here are predators too. So you got the the perch, you got the burbot, uh, I think you got even the golden shiner. So it doesn't matter, you can use a hook 6 too. If you are not, uh, if you don't got access to the hook 1, just use a little bit lower. It doesn't matter really that much. So I'm using full uh, depth 250 centimeters it's a bottom feeder like the carp so go full depth you need to watch it a little bit if you go a little bit close to the shore that you don't get snagged because on the shore it's not that deep okay be very aware guys that you got a license too because if you don't got a license it's a prohibited fish so that means if you catch one and even if you throw it back you are going to get a 2k fine so be sure that you got it because I just had it too. My license expired. Bang, 2k. Uh, fine. That's a lot if you are a low level. And you can get bankrupt on those fish. So let's have a look to the net. 
so you guys will see there is a lot of white suckers in my net and you will see corn and peas are very good i tried red worms but then right away i had to throw the yellow bird i saw a guy just on the stream uh catching one with grasshoppers that's uh, unexpected but uh, yeah it seems to work but if you come here get your corn get your peas start farming nice currency nice experience so that's how you do it that was my movie i'm now off to the trophy northern pike in alberta trying to make a movie about that this was a movie about the white sucker a cool fish a beautiful fish a good experience fish and it's fun fishing with the telescopic on the white sucker thanks for watching guys see you later have a nice one bye bye